What if I tell you this is not your regular tomato stew? Yes, this is a watermelon stew made from watermelon. It is super, super delicious and it is also very easy to make. I'm going to be showing you step by step how to make this recipe. It is very easy to make. So these are all the ingredients we need for this recipe. This is everything you need. So here we have all the ingredients and this is the star of the show. Watermelon, you need one watermelon. You need fresh tatashi, fresh pepper and chombo. You also need green bell pepper. You also need beetroot for extra color. You need some fresh carrots. You can use any protein of your choice. Today I'm going to be making use of chicken and fish. You can also skip this part. I'm going to be adding some ginger, garlic and turmeric. So I'll be blending all this now with my blender. So I'm adding in my turmeric, ginger and uh, garlic. You can skip this part if you don't like it. So I'm also adding in my fresh So this is what it looks like after blending Isn't this amazing? There is no tomatoes added to this recipe No tin tomatoes added to this recipe It is very very delicious I'll be adding the remaining part of the watermelon and I'll be blending this as well. So here I'll be adding some onions. This is just so amazing. So now I'm going to be frying this. First I'll add my onion into the hot oil. I then add my watermelon mixed. Note this recipe doesn't require any extra water because watermelon has a lot of water in it. So I'm going to be frying this for a while. Yes, the only thing I'll be adding is just salt, no seasoning cube, nothing added. So I'll be adding my meat stock at this point and I'm going to allow it to fry for a while. And this is the result. Isn't this amazing? I hope you'll be trying this recipe. This recipe is super, super easy. It is very nutritious. It is also very delicious. It is very, very cheap to make, especially this period that tomatoes is very, very expensive. So I, I will urge you to try this recipe. So let me know in the comment section, will you be trying this recipe? What do you think about this watermelon stew? The first day I tasted it, it was super, super nice. So I decided to share this recipe with you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope to see you in my next video. Bye.